Hello again, Joseph Stasinus, the unretired entrepreneur. When you love what you do, why retire? Uh, back again for a short video. Uh, today, I want to do a follow-up on what I spoke about last week, uh, which was uh, why you should never retire. Um, rather, uh, stay engaged in life no matter how old you are and can continue to contribute and live a balanced life based on that. Uh, today, I just want to add a little bit to that, and I'm going to call this the myth of retirement, because as I uh, uh, wrote in my last uh, blog post uh, about uh, the origins of retirement, uh, you know, back in the, I believe, the 1800s, the 19th century, uh, one of uh, the leaders of, uh, I think it was Germany, uh, Bismarck, I believe it was, came up with the idea of retirement because he was trying to get the older people to retire so that more uh, jobs could be available for the younger people because that was a challenge, uh, you know, a big problem for them at that time. So uh, in any event, he came up with that idea and then it just blossomed from there and, you know, where we are today, but it's really just to stay the mind. And uh, when you get into that stay the mind, you're just preparing for a lot of times you're just preparing for the time that you can retire and not have to do anything and okay i put in my i paid my dues i put in the years and uh, now i just lay back and uh, relax and until the time comes to explore different dimensions um but you know i mean to me that's not the wisest thing and uh, just because uh, that's the way it's been set up to do over the past century and a half or so it doesn't mean that's the correct way to do it, especially for your own unique le uh, needs and your own desires and your own purpose in life. So um, to me, it's all a myth. Uh, retirement, uh, you know, when you're in fully engaged in life, you're never retired, uh, regardless of being paid for what you're doing or not. If you're doing, you know, volunteer work or you're in your own business, making money or working for someone, um, the key element is, are you contributing and are you enjoying how you're contributing? Are your values in life uh, in alignment with the objectives, goals, and end results you're looking to attain? And if they are, then, you know, things run really smoothly and, uh, <clears throat> you know, there's never a reason to retire because there's always more creative ideas to come up with, more innovative ways to do things um, and to stay engaged. Uh, no matter how much money you have at any point in your life, there's always, uh, you know, something else to do productively. Uh, you know, again, like I mentioned before, there's only so much partying you could do, so many hobbies you could do, uh, you know, without getting bored. And, uh to lead a meaningful life is being engaged with your true purpose and what your values are and to be expressing that on a daily basis and doing things to the best of your ability. You know, people in their 80s, 90s, 100s now are fully engaged, living their lives fully. And there's people in their 20s and 30s, 40s that uh, are not engaged, that are just, you know, going through the motions, uh, surviving. So, you know, the point here being is uh, retirement is a myth. It's a matter of getting involved in activities that you really enjoy and are meaningful to you and make a positive difference to yourself, to others, and to the world in general. All right. Well, that's it for today. I just wanted to, you know, follow up on my last uh, video on uh, why to never retire with this uh, video called The Myth of Retirement. So uh, I look forward that everybody's having a fantastic weekend. I look forward that everything's going well. And I will then uh, catch up with you guys a little later. Okay, take care.